apart from everything else that I've got going on in the garden at the moment, I've got an area right at the bottom of the garden that I actually grassed in October last year. I basically just levelled it out, gave it a bit of a rake and then just scattered loads of grass seed, covered it up and then just left it be. See what happened and it was basically just dead soil that I lightly covered with a bit of compost and just flattened it down to get a bit of a level on it. And now we've got grass come through which has been growing over winter. I'm now going to use that to make like a little bit of a beer garden. But I want to add some other bits to it like some flowers and maybe I've got a little pallet out there that I've actually converted uh, to put flowers in. So I'm probably going to move out there as well. I've got a nice big round table uh, with its own seating attached to it but it's a bit rickety so I'm going to have to fix that. So that's just something else I can make a little start on and I'll show you whereabouts I'm talking about. So this is basically the area that we grassed last year and it was quite effortless to do to be fair like I said bit of a rake leveled it out threw some seeds on and left it be all through winter and that used to be an old dog pen not mine it was just left here by the previous owners so I'm going to get that all cleared out I've already pretty much cut most of this old dead tree down as well but I'm going to get that cleared out maybe give it a bit of a paint up over the next few weeks and have a few flowers in that there I think it'll look nice not today like because it's so windy and then I've got this table which is basically a nice nice little round table with its own seating attached to it but it has seen better days so I'm going to give this a fix up and then we can pop that on that grass area and have a nice little seating area once we do actually get some decent weather to sit and have a drink and I've also got this little burner as well which we can use to just burn little bits of old scrap wood and as it starts to get a little bit dull at night time it'll also keep us warm on top but the first thing I need to do is get all this cleared up So we've got it cleared out a little bit, didn't take too long, 20 minutes or so. Obviously still needs a little bit more work on this frame because this is going to be a shelter just in case during summer you get one of those days where you have a sudden downpour and instead of running all the way back down to house, which is quite a long way, we can just nip under here. But this is what I wanted to show you. This is a piece of tree trunk that I saw in somebody's garden and they were kind enough to get a chainsaw and cut me a slice off and I just found it really comical so we've had this a couple of years it needs a bit of work now, it's getting a bit old but it's an amusing decorative piece to the garden so I've also got this pallet that we've converted into a planter just by putting some wood across bottom and then drilling holes on the inside and I'm going to fill that with some violas I think it'll look quite nice we've already got the middle section planted up with Semper Vivums so now it's a case of how do I position it because I am going to have to paint the front of the shed up as well and do some more tidying I was just going to get a few flowers in this. Got them spare, them cheap ones. They only cost about 15 pence each, these flowers, so it's 
going to make a nice decoration to this pallet. So we've made a bit of a start on that now. We've got a smiley tree trunk, which always makes you laugh. And then we've just quickly planted up this pallet with those really cheap violas to add a little bit of colour to it. And just screwed it to the side of its shed. We'll do something about this tarp as well, that'll be coming down. And maybe a little bit of seating inside here as well. But yeah, from a, a dog shed basically that was full of rubbish, I just cut that front out and took it away to leave an open area but also providing a bit of shelter in the event of it raining. But considering that only a few months ago this was dead ground with no grass on it whatsoever and just for the sake of a bit of raking and a bit of seed it's come through through winter. And now what we need to do is work on this table, get it fixed up and get everything set up ready for summer and then I think once we've got it all together it's going to be a nice little area to sit and relax at night time so I thought that was worth a try getting something set up ready for summer months once we get past the cold the wind and the rain and we get a few weeks at least where it's nice enough just to sit out, relax and have a drink and we're going to get as little private seated area all set up ready for that anyway thanks for watching this video really appreciate it and I'll see you next time